so this woman is looking for a sister wife. Let's see. Oh my God. Hey, hey. you're here. I know I got on earlier and I um was driving. I like didn't expect you to pick me up. Like tried to get on here so many times. It was ridiculous. Okay, what's your name? Rajne. Rajne, where are you calling us from? Michigan. Michigan, how old are you? 26 on fri Friday. 26, so you're a Gemini? Yes. Okay. Do you Damn have any kids? Gemini, Gemini. Yes, I have a seven year old. A seven year old? Okay. This is Rajane, Michigan, 26, Gemini, seven year old. What do you do for a living? Um, I have my own business. I'm an entrepreneur. I do psychic readings and make holistic bath bombs and artwork. Pretty what much. do you do for a living? Um, I'm a psychic reader and I make holistic bath bombs and different types of things like that. Oh, you're a psychic reader. Did you know you're going to get on the show tonight? No, I had no idea. <laughs> I should a psychic reader. Oh, you might make some men up, um, nervous. They were like, who's she going to find me bullshit. out? Hey, oh, look, I'm bullshit. Uh, on the truth. That's what it is. I vibrate at that level. So, sure. Okay. She wasn't vibrates. looking for a man, though. Sure. I'm not here looking for a guy. So, I just want to be like, off rip with Say again? I'm here looking for like a, a girlfriend or like a sister wife. I'm not here looking for a boyfriend. I have a woman. Yes. So are you a lesbian? No, I am bi pansexual actually. Um, I started dating women or girls at a young age. And uh, my first boyfriend ended up being my child's father and so on and so forth, you know, but. So what's, what's the difference between pansexual and bisexual? Um, kind of like, I'm just not big into labels. So that's really what pansexuality kind of means. It's like, you like somebody because of who they are and not what they go by or like any type of boundary keeping them from just being themselves. You just enjoy that person. And I'm also a sapiosexual. So I like intelligent people. Okay. Okay. So what gender did you date last? I'm dating right now. Like I said, I do have a boyfriend, but we're looking for a girlfriend. Oh, oh, so you are in a relationship with a guy and you came on the show to find a girl to add to your relationship? Yeah. Well, even even if just to add to my life or mm. add to our life, because I just I really value having a woman, you know, aspect in my life to like for companionship and just as far as communicating. There's a lot of things that women give each other that men can't, even if it's not anything sexual, just as far as like being around, being there understanding understanding you know stuff like that so you want a woman not just for sexual pleasure you want a woman as a relationship desire and that's some earthly chicks man that's how they be dog they be on some extra looking at life from a whole deep perspective bro i ain't got time for all that shit dog i don't even want to put it as if that's like the expectation or anything but i definitely want somebody to you know understand me i want an emotional connection before anything else so do so you and your boyfriend live together Yes. So do you want this woman to move in with you guys? It's a possibility. We've talked about it, but we're not really sure. It would be solely based on pretty much what we figure out as we're like growing together. It wouldn't be out of the question though. Okay. So this kind of woman, what kind of woman are you looking for? Um, so I am not really <laughs> okay so i'm like a really outgoing person i like to go outside i like camping i'm really outdoorsy i'm just looking for somebody who's honest transparent and like um probably i don't mind somebody who works a job but like if you're an entrepreneur you're trying to pursue something out bigger than just being you know working for somebody else but there's nothing wrong with that but like i'm looking for somebody with an open mind and creative abilities you know to add to my life too and like the same vice versa okay mm -hmm. what's some deal breakers for you and your boyfriend um like lying stealing hmm. that's pretty that's like pretty much it not to have too many kids i guess i don't have a problem with people having multiple kids i love children i just probably wouldn't want to date somebody who has more than two also or uh, has any type of extra drama in their life because I don't want to deal with that. We just really laid back. I'm really like hippie like, like I said, That's you problem. know, I'm just really relaxed. So I don't really like anybody 
who agitates that type of environment. I'm, I do morning meditations. I'm real chill. So, so will this woman, will she date you separately and your boyfriend separately, or she's always dating both of you guys at the same both. time? Yeah, it's a partnership. Me and my boyfriend have been together. So you're not going to come into the relationship and date me and then date him. Like, okay. it's going to be like a thing. And it's, you know what I mean? It's going to be like us communicating together. And off rip, it's not, oh, I'm meeting somebody and we're dating or something like that. You know, it's like if you decide or we all decide that this is something that works, it's not just me deciding you work for me. I don't I don't think like that. So I did it a buy chick before and she was on some I gotta have my shit separate from you because like the jealousy of me dealing with a woman. Like you, you dealing with a woman, like what that shit was crazy as hell. So her saying that I respect that. Like, you know, I'm really oriented on making a group setting work and things like that. So we're um, Rashana, right? Rajane. 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 Child, be messing names up. I apologize. Oh, hey, Does this woman have to be in Michigan? It's a big ass What'd you say? Does she have to be in Michigan? Um, No, she could be She could be wherever. It doesn't matter. She could be anywhere. What's the age range? Um, 22 to 30, I'll say. 22 to 30. Um, does she have to look a certain way? Be physically in shape. I mean, no more than 180. Okay, no more than 180. And you said she can have kids. Does she got to make a certain amount of money? No, no. No? Okay. No, she, has to, she just has to have the ability to go out and make money, though. Mm -hmm. The ability to have to go out and get it, the ambition to, like, create things and even if she's not working for something just hmm. to have some type of hustle about them okay. have a hustle about them okay so this is rajane in michigan 26 um a gemini so have you and your boyfriend ever had this scenario before mm, good question. no this will be new for us but not new for me this is something that i've like experienced since i was younger um when i had my son at 17 i was involved with somebody who was 23 at the time and i kind of just had a more, I wouldn't even say evolved because you're not really even truly evolved at 23, but like, <laughs> I just had some broad experiences though. Some that even people, you know, in their forties or fifties never experienced. So I hmm. got to, you know, date multiple people and experience that and, you know, have a partner who was okay with that and been in relationships where people were understanding about my sexuality and my needs. And that's kind of the situation I'm in with my boyfriend. He's not pursuing a girlfriend unless I'm pursuing one. And we're not hmm. doing it individually, we're doing it together. It just so happened he's not here right now, but I would have put him on here too. Is it <laughs> is it his idea or your idea to add a girl? Hers. My idea. Your idea. So yeah. why would a woman be lucky to be in your relationship? Um, Because there's the, like I said, there's the aspect of having the emotional support of just being able to have somebody to talk to, be there for you emotionally, and also the business aspect. If you're looking for things like that, people's brains to pick, we're always literally trying to evolve and expand what we have going on. And, you know, I've been in accounting since I was 19, and my boyfriend is also an electrician. We have our own things going on, our own businesses, and I just feel like we could add value to <laughs> having somebody else in our corner and having other minds to connect with. So the I thing like about it is like, it's like, that's a great question by Kendra because like, why would she go ahead and join y'all situation where she can go ahead and start her own little situation and get her own little piece on the side. So what, what what's the sin of like, um, does he have a lot of money or you guys going to take care of her? Like, like that's the thing about it. Like most of these polyamorous relationships, the guy has a lot of cash and makes the other girl who up comes in. It's a great offer on offer. They can't refuse on so many fronts. It's a great deal for them. That's a good question. That would be good for anybody. Okay. I think we're having Wi-Fi issues, but I'm going to try to keep going. Um, are, is there any nervousness about what if you're the girl and your guy end up liking each other and then they split from you in the relationship? You know, like when I was like younger and I'm still young, I'm only 26, but like mm -hmm. I became more secure with myself though, you know, and I don't feel like I'm insecure in my relationship where that would happen. But if it did, I'd probably be happy that my partner found somebody who actually could 
like you know make them happy i'm not what? very possessive like that so it wouldn't be some relationship where spirit. you would be like you know i just i'm not like that so i don't even toy with that type of mentality like i make things i, I like transparency and if you can't be transparent i'm gonna see right through it so there's she not, doesn't have an ego though know, she doesn't okay, have okay okay well let's do it now Say your name again, because I don't want to pronounce it wrong. Rajane. I just Rajane, go- Rajane in Michigan. She's 26, a Gemini, has a seven-year-old entrepreneur. She's in a relationship. She came on looking for a sister wife. So she's looking for a female to add to her current relationship. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. I'm going to get up out of here, though. Stacy, shout out to Kendra G, doing his job, man. I'm going to sign out, man.